my name is Katie Tolio, and I'm an instructor at Combat Sports Academy. Um, in terms of what I'm doing now, I never thought that I would be doing what I'm doing ever. That was not any thought that possibly crossed my mind. Mm -hmm. um, I liked uh, punching my boy cousins in the face when I was a kid, but that was the only thing that could have given me a clue. So <laughs> um, I didn't have any idea, you know, mm -hmm. and then I walked into uh, a gym just to do some stress relief from uh, what at the time was my job, and I ended up um, loving it. I ended up loving Krav Maga, and then later on loving Muay Thai and fighting Muay Thai, and um, later on coaching. So, um, you know, and then loving coaching even more than I love training. So um, it was something that I didn't really find out about myself until the last few years. Um, nothing really gave me a clue before, but when it happened, I was like, yes, this is what I want to do. Within your journey, what do you think is the most valuable lesson that, that you've learned so far? Um, you know, there's there's a lot of valuable lessons, so mm -hmm. uh, it's hard to pluck out just one. Um, if I if I would say specific to my journey, um, that uh, you never know, you know, you're you're not destined for anything, you're not fated for anything, and what you end up being passionate about and loving in your life um, can surprise you. So try everything, do everything, be open to everything, and if something captures your heart a little bit, chase it. I mean, I get a lot from my students, uh -huh. you know, they're, they're, uh, I get inspired every day, all the time. There are times that, I, you know, I ask them to do something, and I, I'm kind of thinking to myself, okay, well, it's the attempt that matters. No one's going to complete this, but, you know, smashed, and, um, you know, I, I get, I get surprised, and, and amazed um, at how much work people are capable of, of how much growth. So, um, you know, just kind of a reminder from my own humility and, and my own um, good luck to be able to work with the people I work with. So That's awesome. There was something to just take some joy out of the fact that I was fighting and I was alive. Um, and I think that that can apply to the rest of your life. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe we don't succeed at everything maybe you don't get everything you want but if you can honestly assess yourself and look back and say I tried my hardest I gave it my best I did everything that there was that was in me um, and it didn't happen for me but that's okay because I did it and I I'm alive and I fought for it you know mm -hmm. um, and you have a sense of joy from that so you know and afterwards uh, you know she had had um, you know, uh, quite a few more fights than I'd had at the time. And she came up to, she went, up, she went on to win the gold. And she came up to me after her and she was like, you are the hardest fight I've ever had. That's awesome. Yeah, I was the smallest girl she ever fought. She said I was the hardest fight she ever had. We actually ended up being, you know, friends on Facebook. We uh -huh. gave each other little gifts. We were like, oh, besties, you're awesome. Because <laughs> um, it was, it was, you know, I think that she won an award too. She wasn't there to walk over anybody, you know. Yeah. Um, so your accomplishments and even your... Uh, uh, things that you don't manage to get are more valuable because you worked for it. That's fantastic. I think that, uh, you know, that that effort, that trying means more than anything. And that, you know, it's okay to be a little bit lost sometimes. <laughs> you know, if I, if I, my whole journey with ending up coaching sort of began because I got laid off from my regular job. Um, and, uh, if, I hadn't, if that hadn't happened and I had been facing being broke and not being sure what to do with myself and, you know, trying to look for something else and kind of hitting that low point, um, I never would have ended up finding something that I wanted to really, you know, call my life's work, you know, so, um, so take it, take it all, you know, the bad stuff can be good stuff too.